Hi, I'm Mark Waite and welcome to Mark My Words. Step two of my 10 bold steps uh, in helping overcome a setback. And step number two is take small steps daily. When I was going through my setback, the overwhelming emotional gravity of it was some days almost unbearable. And so once I'd made a decision to get off the canvas, my next goal was to start to develop some habits. And by that I mean start to get a sense of achievement again. And it had been a while. I'd been in the uh, pits of um, despair and frustration and, um, and self-pity for quite a while. And so I hadn't really experienced those little wins that you need when you embark on recovery. So step number two for me was to make start small and, and just to take small steps every day. So for me, I had to look at it and go, all right, let's start the day with a list and write down just a few things. For me, initially, it was just two or three things I wanted to achieve that day. And they could have been as small as, I don't know, just going for a walk for 20 minutes or reading something inspirational or making a phone call, that a tough phone call that I needed to make uh, to a creditor or someone who I owed money to, uh, as an example. And just writing those things down at the start of the day. So at the end of the day, you can look at the list and see some ticks. And for that, for me, that really gave me a sense of, and a much needed sense of achievement. And it mightn't sound like a lot, but when you're going through a tough time and you're really in the midst of a setback, you're looking for any kind of positive reinforcement to start that habit of achievement. And it just starts small, right? Make a list, two or three things, tick them off at the end of the day, and then that list, as that becomes a habit, will become bolder with bigger steps that you can take. Uh, don't do too many steps too soon. Start small, and then that'll set you up with a great foundation to get into the next step, which is step three, which we'll cover on the next video.